call me when you get this. I want to make sure we're looking at all the options, okay? Hi. I didn't hear you leave this morning. Well, you were finally getting some sleep. I didn't have the heart to wake you. You don't have to sneak out. I think I needed to deal with this myself. Am I hovering too much? Oh, gosh, no. I mean, it can't be any more than Spinelli. Spinelli's been actually making my meals, you know, and he's been cooking me vegetables, actually counting my vegetables, and he made me this tea, and it tastes like dirt. It was really gross, but he said that it would promote healing and help my anxiety, but I don't know how that's going to help because he's been hovering so much. It was really nice to go to Kelly's and have coffee with Abby, though, because I haven't been able to have that in a while. Yeah, is that why you're so wound up, because of Abby? I don't know how she's so calm about everything, but she's dealing with it really well. You want to tell me what's really going on? You don't have to if you don't want to. Okay. I finally had my last post-op exam with Kelly Lee. And I thought I was ready to hear what she had to tell me. But I guess I wasn't. The procedure was a success. Once I am done healing with the surgery, I should be able to carry a baby to full term. Uh, I, I, I don't... Mm -hmm. You go. Okay. Um, I'm not exactly sure how I thought I was going to feel about this, but I have a million emotions running through my mind right now. I'm happy for you. Me too. I mean, just to have the choice is a privilege, right? I mean, I'm happy. I am happy. I'm... I'm scared. I am thrilled. I don't know. You can pick from any one of these emotions because there are a lot of them. right now. Neither do I. Okay. We don't have to rush into anything either. Okay. Yeah. Look, we just have to be honest with each other. Even if it means that we're not going to have a child. I don't... I don't really know what I want. I do know one thing for sure. What's that? I love you so much. 